Hello and welcome to the finale of the Pokédesk Christmas Crazy 2023 event. That's a mouthful. I need to change that. Um, <laughs> uh, today, we're going Mini Tin Madness. We got this Mini Tin Monstrosity. Mini and Monstrosity in the same sentence. It makes sense, okay? Um, then, we got two of the 151s. We also have four of this guy here. And um, if we get lucky, then they didn't update the packs in it. And it is a three-year-old tin that has some good packs in it. But we'll, we'll get to that. Um, and then just in case we didn't succeed and they did update the packs, we do still have one of the XY breakpoint. That way, uh, you get something vintage-ish. Alright, get into this big guy first here. for swirls. Um, I don't think we're going to sleeve any of these today um, just because, well, I just, I'm just not sure about them. So, but we do get the full lineup of these mini tins. We'll see what's in them. Bam. All right. All right. So we'll get these. I don't think I spotted a single swirl amongst them, but they are, nope, they're not all Paldea Evolves, there's one Scarlet and Violet base in there, interesting, I do think we will have Scarlet and Violet base and, uh, and Paldea Evolved in these tents, that's my guess, because I do not know for sure, but let's find out, oh, oh, we get that, we get the sticker, Scarlet and Violet and Silver Tempest is what we're getting. Okay. Pulling all these things to the side here. I have uh, quite a few mini tins after this. So, we'll start with Silver Tempest, I guess. Set these tins kind of up here out of the way. Um, yeah. Good luck, us. Right, first pack, Silver Tempest. Pull that Lugia, get it over with. No, no uh, nothing on that one. Bam. And Scarlet and Violet, we got a daunting amount of mini tins to open. Co guard, we might have something. Nope. Next one, we got the Quagsley. And it should all be the same packs. Maybe. Yep, Scarlet and Violet and Silver Tempest. Same order. You get the oh, thank you, uh, Drew Dagon, and behind it the Swin Arcanine, Arcanine B. That means any difference? Oh. Excuse me. All right, we got our first polls of the video though. Both doubles, but with. A set that we went so hard on, like Silver Tempest. It's bound to happen. Alright. 
Nice double banger, though. Nice double banger. We can still get something from Silver, from Silver Tempest. From Scarlet and Violet Base. But bam, there is two. Let's get right into Scarlet and Violet now. Come on. And we got cats freaking out. Ooh. Ooh, and we get the Nest Ball Gold card behind it. And Oink Loin EX. We're seeing gold. It's not a bad day. Never a bad day when you're seeing gold. Let's get the Oink Loin EX up first here. Our cat's running through. Not even Christmas is spared. Oh, Merry Christmas, by the way. Um, you guys will be watching this on Christmas, so... Merry, 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 merry Christmas. All right. There is our gold nest ball. I actually think that might be a new one, but we may have pulled it. We did go pretty hard on Scarlet Violet Base as well. Um, we're still missing a ton of alt arts from Scarlet and Violet Base, though. So, um, yeah, yeah. Would be nice to get the Spring God out on. Oof, okay. All right, there is that artwork. Scarlet and Violet Base. What do you know? Silver Tempest. We have two more tins after this one to go through. Man. We're going to have a few of those. Code card. Did I just... I just said code card before I even had it anywhere near my hand. Okay, that's fine. Ooh, and we do get the Radiant Alakazam and the Incineroar behind it. Bam. That is one of the cooler Radiants they ever made. Um, definitely better than the Pokemon Go Radiants, that's for sure. You guys know what I'm talking about. They were ugly. Okay. I'd say that's not a good sign, but we're on back into Scarlet and Violet, so it does not matter. Let's see. No, we get the Quagball Hollow. Not that there's any non-hollow rares in Scarlet and Violet era. Right, we get the Pikachu tin. I what was the last one? No, no. Yeah, that one can't even pass some of something. Alright, we get that, that. Just, yeah, stacking a mini tin glory down there. Alright, come on. Go card. No matter what, honestly, not bad pulls. But let's get something else here. Come on, come on, come on. Another nest ball? What are the odds of pulling two golden nest balls in the same box? Um, probably pretty low, but hey, there we go, we did it. Hilarious. Cannot believe we just, I you know, was thinking this, it's got to be a different one, right? But two gold nest balls, just like that. Last tin of Silver Tempest and Scarlet and Violet base. Then we'll be moving into the 151 mini tins. We got two of those. What do you know? We did not pull anything really. Oh, actually, we did. We pulled, pulled, pulled stuff from both sets. So, hopefully, that continues. Yeah. The last Silver Tempest pack here. Well, we might have more. I'm, you know, you never know. But, should be. 
And we do get the Reggie Alecki V. I do not mind finishing off that with a regular V. I'm also starting a binder and trying to fill it entirely with Vs. And then, you know, the EXs and another one for Terras and um, I think it'll be kind of aesthetically pleasing when it's done. Um, well, that opened oddly. All right, all right. Give me pull something at the end here. And we do, we get the mob stiff, looking, just begging at the table. We have seen that one before, but it is a great artwork. Get that in his sleeve. I think we will fill up the table today. Any luck, in, a, in Christmas fashion. Almost out of top loaders though, so we may have to open another package of those. Luckily my Beautiful wife got us some top loaders. All right, we're on to 151. Maybe it wants to open up. Oh, that's the way it wants to open. Do we get a coin? Then, perfect. I haven't got that coin yet, so that works for me. There's the little artwork page and two 151 packs. See if the Magneton and Ekans wants to do a solid. Add it to our Leaning Tower of Magnetons. Alright. Can we get a God Pack today? Please. Like I'm, I'm saying that, like that's super easy to find. What's going on with that? Like a weird hollow going on, but yep, nothing on that one. <laughs> we need a, uh, a ton of art rares from this set still. So, something would be nice. Hmm. Got one more tin after this one, though, so we get one more shot. Let's see. Completely striking out on that one. I did not look for a hollow energy. That last pack. Nope, no, no hollow energy. Alright. Last one, 51 tin. And then hopefully we'll have all the packs coming up here. Let's see what our coin, we get the dragon energy coin this time. That actually tracks being like the dragonite. Steel and actually track two for the other. Interesting. Bam. Alright. Let's get something. Let's get something. We did do very good on the 151 UPC video. Still didn't get very many art rares, but you know. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that video just a couple days ago. There's the Mewtwo. Wherever I'm trying to put my cards today. All right, last pack 151, then we're getting into our last sets of mini tins here. It is a code card, and I think, yeah, we might have some gold. And we get the switch. That is the last gold card we needed. And it looks like we might have a triple banger pack. We got a switch, we got the Arbok EX, and we get the Psychic Energy Hollow. Very cool lineup. What a way to end off the 151s. Alright, we're, we're going to do the Hollow Energy first, though, because that's the least important. We'll work our way up. I think this might use all of our top loaders perfectly, too. And I definitely want us to pull some more stuff from the next box. All right, I'm gonna leave. I can't, I can't, I gotta, gotta even it out. There we go, perfect. Now we got Arbok, 
ex and finally a gold switch card maybe if I can grab it cool there we go but we have one top loader left and we'll have to open another package I'm shaking my camera too there you go not perfect. It'll do. It'll do. All right. It is time to find out if this was a crazy find or if there's going to be nothing special about it at all. Looks like we might have to cut into all of these, though, because they seal them a lot better than the newer ones. That's for sure. All right. All right moment of truth. Come on, show us the goods. Oh, they updated it. I was afraid of that. They updated it. Um, two fusion strikes. Oof. I was afraid of that. That's okay. That's just how it goes sometimes. Sometimes you get lucky. Originally, those tins had XY Evolutions and Sword and Shield Base. So, very much hoping for that lineup. Uh, but, okay then. <laughs> Crazy cats. Alright. I was really hoping for that lineup, but Pokemon Center is notorious for that. They like to switch out what comes in things and, uh, not update the listing. There is Chili, Chilin, and Cress. <laughs> Full Art Trainer, that is a cool card though. We will more than happily take that as the cats continue to be crazy. Boom, very cool card. If you did not see the, um, the video about, or the video that kicked off the Pokedesk Christmas Crazy event, the one about good, good item pick, good gift ideas. Gosh, I can't, I can't talk today. But had some fusion, fusion strike surprises in that one. So if you haven't seen it, strongly recommend. Strongly do. Let's see. Come on. Nothing on that one. That is okay though. Let's get. We're just gonna try to blow through these now that we know it has nothing. We will try to make them fast. Well, they can still have some good stuff. There's still quite a lot of cards from Fusion Strike. Oof, they're all gonna be Charizard coins, aren't they? Bam. Two more Fusion Strike for the pile. We do have that emergency XY pack, a breakpoint, so not to worry. We will still get some XY action. Go card. No, we get the Feraligator Hollow. We got a Puppy Swarm. Code card. Let's see. No, nothing on that one either. On to the other one. We got two more tins after this. Oh, very, very, very scratched up. Charizard. Right. Is the code card for you guys, and let's get some more luck. Come on. 
the Deoxys Hollow. Not that one. Alright. Another one. Last 10. Last 10, and then we will end today everything off. If you guys enjoyed the Pokédesk Christmas Crazy event, please make sure you're liking and commenting on stuff. It lets me know that this was a success, and I will do it again next year. If not, then, you know, it's up in the air, because uh, I decide what goes on. <laughs> There is the last two packs Fusion Strike. Let's get some luck here. Just a little bit more. We'll be happy. We're needy like that. Ooh, okay. We get the Gold Flaffy. That is actually really crazy. Um, very off-center. Very off-center. But a very nice card. A very nice card. I don't know if I've ever pulled a gold card from Fusion Strike before. Very cool. Actually, I have. I have. I've. Is the Bolton. Is Bolton even in this set? I don't know. I couldn't tell you. Okay, we got a. Open up another thing of top loaders. <laughs> Old box out of the way. Alright, let's try out these new top loaders. Bam. Perfect. Looking good. Extend that out that way. Bam. We have completely filled up the board now. We're gonna start putting stuff over things. But only two packs left. Hopefully we can get another pull or two. Oof, not on this one. So hopefully we can get some last pack magic with our X, Y, breakpoint. Older packs, you always gotta check the seals, make sure there's no glue anywhere. Code card. Very cool artworks though. Glamio, we got the Drowsy Reverse, and we did get the Zebra Strike. I kind of peeked. I kind of peeked at the co card as I put it down. That's a very cool Arcanine. I may have saw it coming. Um, but again, Merry Christmas, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed, enjoyed the video. If you did, please like the video, comment, subscribe with the ringy ding long bell on. And I will see you guys on the next video. Bye now.